the other granddaughter that came to live with us was eight years old. And what her and I have in common is being tenderhead. <laughs> oh, my gosh. The sounds coming out of that little girl when her mama picks up a comb and brush. Ah! 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 Oh, no, it hurts, it hurts, it hurts. I wish I could have made those kind of sounds when my mother was going to do my hair. The worst day was Sunday mornings because in the kitchen there was this drawer that held torture instruments called a straightening comb and some hot curlers. Ooh. Sunday mornings was the worst. Early in the morning, my mother would turn on the stereo, turn it up loud, and all you heard through the whole house was gospel music. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Until it wasn't <laughs> when she called my name. And uh, the knot in the pit of my stomach would just get started. I would hear that chair scrape across the kitchen floor to take its place next to the stove. <laughs> and then I heard the tick, tick, tick of that gas flame coming on. And then I heard the voice. Kay, bring your tail in this kitchen and bring that hair grease with you. Oh, no. Oh, Lord, oh, Lord, that was the long from my bedroom to the kitchen. Lord have mercy, can I get a witness? Woo! And I sat down in that chair, right next to the stove. And I waited for her hand to slide that hair grease on around my head. <laughs> And she plucked up the edges. Ooh, the edges. Ooh, God, the edges. The edges, the edges. Ooh. And then I heard the sizzle of them nets just straight on out. Ooh, Lord, have mercy. And if I didn't get to my ears before she got to that part, them scars will show up. And don't get me started. On the kitchen. Oh, Woo! oh but when it's over, ha, when that can't do was over, ha, I got to and I got to shut my window and shut my window. Woo! Oh, Woo! I had to dance. I put on that Sunday dress and went on to church. 